Welcome to the Shop LC Kitchen, everybody. I want to show you the Home Smart handheld USB rechargeable cordless mixer. And it's going to be perfect for mixing up your favorite cream pies, your puddings, your souffles, your eggs, or maybe even making a fresh batch of whipped cream to top off your favorite holiday drinks or just an everyday cup of coffee. This is available in three different colors, but I'm going to show you the green because it was my favorite. You're going to get two whisk attachments. One is your traditional whisk for eggs or anything you'd like to mix. And then there's another whisk that's really cool. This one is specifically designed for cream. And because it's specifically designed for cream, that's exactly what we're going to do. Now, your USB charger cable is included, and you'll notice that this is a standard connector. It will fit into any wall charger that you already own, so you don't have to worry about that. Really simple on off. Three speeds. So we're gonna kick it into high gear and get this whipped cream going. This is gonna be one of the components in a lemon cream pie that features some sugar-free lemon gelatin, some sugar-free vanilla pudding, some real whipped cream, and a little bit of cream cheese as well. All right, the next step is two cups of milk. I used whole milk. I want full fat in this recipe. And I'm gonna take one packet of sugar-free lemon, gel lemon gelatin. And I'm gonna sprinkle it over the milk. And I'm gonna mix just a little bit. And you're gonna see right away, the whisk incorporates a lot of air. So you get that lemon flavor. It's already a lemon cream flavor, just with the whole milk. Now I'm gonna add about half a packet of instant vanilla pudding. And in just a little bit, it's gonna to come together really nicely. Okay, the next step is a packet of cream cheese. I have this at room temperature, and I'm just beginning to break it up a little bit. And now I'm gonna add a little bit of the milk and gelatin mixture. The cream cheese will make it nice and smooth, and we're gonna keep incorporating it just a little bit at a time until it's all worked in and it's silky smooth. All right, now we've got only one little bit of mixing left to do before our lemon cream pie is ready to go. You can use a prepared graham cracker crust. One of my local grocery stores has started carrying a low carb pecan crust. So if you can find a nut crust, you can easily do that just as well. So a little bit of a spatula, and we're gonna put the cream into the pudding gelatin mixture. And one of the reasons I really like this is because it's got a very light lemon flavor. It's not super tangy or super tart. You get this gorgeous kind of creamy, silky look to it. So I'm just gonna very easily fold in that mixture. And listen, if you didn't wanna use uh, whipped cream, you could easily use a container of uh, prepared whipped topping, but man, there's just nothing like real whipped cream. And with a mixer like this one, it's just, it's easy. You saw that cream, we whipped up a pint of cream in just a few minutes. All right, here you have it. Now there's a little bit left over. You could actually pile this really super high, put a little bit of whipped, topping on the top 
But honestly, this is really tasty and delicious, just like it is. When I get to this point, I usually put the cover back on it, stick it back in the refrigerator, let the center, let the center part set up, and it is delicious. If you want to be super fancy, get a couple of lemon slices on top and do a little garnish on the top. But I'm going to tell you, you will love this, and it's low sugar.